Dr. Hajal, basic question. How much sleep do we need to get? The typical eight hours, is that? That's true. We still don't have a clear scientific answer to tell you. It's still true what your grandma said, uh, perhaps, that uh, you need somewhere between seven and nine hours. And the majority of the people, almost 80% of the people, would require something around that. Uh, but which tells you that almost 20% of the people can mm -hmm. sleep something different. And we're talking about normal sleep, not those who have trouble falling asleep or cannot fall asleep. We're talking about normal sleep, mm -hmm. which means they wake up feeling rested and comfortable. Some people need six hours, some people need 11 hours, so we don't really know. What is a sleep cycle? A sleep cycle is, it's very important when you're sleeping to know that it is not one stage of sleep. So it's not like our bodies go into a mini coma at night. Mm -hmm through the night and then you wake up. To the contrary, actually your brain is working on sleeping. So it has to be a sequence of events that you go through. We know there are three stages of uh, uh, regular sleep and one stage of REM sleep, mm -hmm. uh, rapid eye movement sleep. And, and then of course there is the wake. And those stages don't come just randomly at night. You go from one cycle to another and we, feel, we find that every 90 minutes is almost uh, a cycle. And then you keep repeating that. And the more cycles you will get, the more uh, restful you will feel the next day. And they have to come in this sequence. So if you have a sleep disorder that gives you maybe the uh, same number of minutes at the end of the night, but not in the same sequence, mm -hmm. you will not feel rested the next day. So they have to come in this sequence. So it has to be orchestrated. The brain is doing a process, an active process, to actually wake up feeling rested the next day. So the REM sleep, that's the deepest cycle of the sleep? It's one of the deepest. There is also the, uh, the uh, uh, slow wave sleep, which is, mm. uh, which is a different kind of, of deep sleep. But it's definitely one of the restful sleep uh, that we should get into. So if you don't get that sleep, then you're not going to be refreshed. That's true. And many studies would, would show that they would start eliminating uh, those parts of sleep on, on uh, mm -hmm. uh, volunteers. And they will see what the effect of, of that is. And most of them would end up feeling just completely unable to function, just sleepy. Mm -hmm. uh, and the difference was not that much which, which, with which stage you would block mm -hmm. to, to make you sleepy, so which, which tells us that we actually need all stages of sleep to actually wake up feeling refreshed. Even the lighter stage? The lighter stage is, uh, of course, if you spend too much in the lighter stage, then it's not a refreshing sleep. Right. So you, you do need a little bit more of the deeper ones. But it's normal for you to spend 20 minutes, 20% uh, 20 of your sleep in lighter stage. That's normal, healthy sleep. Thank you, Dr. Hajal. Thank you.